Welcome back to our channel. Let's have a look at one of the most recent and cutting-edge AI revolution ever. Google AI Project Astra, which was presented at Google I.O. 2024, is expected to be a key tool in Google's AI arsenal. Astra, described as a universal AI agent that is helpful in everyday life, combines the skills of Google Assistant and Google Gemini, improving them with additional features and a conversational interface. This is a tremendous development in AI technology, surpassing existing chatbots and voice assistants. Google plans to make their debut of a new system, Astra, later this year, promising that it would be the most powerful and advanced sort of AI assistant company has ever released. The current generation of AI assistants such as ChatGPT can access information and provide responses, but that's everything about it. However, this year, Google is renaming its assistants as more evolved agents, which it claims can demonstrate thinking, planning and memory skills, as well as take several steps to complete tasks. At Google I.O., the company's annual developer conference, Hasabis demonstrated a very early concept of what he thought would become the universal assistant. Google refers to it as Project Astra, and it is a real-time, multimodal AI assistant capable of seeing the world, knowing where objects are and where you left them, and answering operations or assisting you with nearly any task. In an exceedingly stunning demo video, which Hasabis says is not manufactured or doctored in any way, an Astra user at Google's London office requests that the system identify a part of a speaker, locate their misplaced glasses, review code, and more. It all operates in real time and in a really conversational manner. Astra is one of several Gemini announcements at this year's I.O. A new model, named Gemini 1.5 Flash, is intended to be faster for typical tasks such as summarization and captioning. Another new model, Veo, can generate video based on a text command. Gemini Nano, the variant meant for local use on devices such as your phone, is also said to be speedier than ever before. The context window for Gemini Pro, which refers to how much knowledge the model can evaluate in a particular query, has doubled to 2 million tokens, and Google claims the model is better than ever at following instructions. Google is making rapid progress both on the models directly and in putting them in front of users. According to Hasabis, the future of AI will be about what it can do for you rather than the models themselves. And that story revolves around agents, which are bots that not only communicate with you, but also complete tasks on your behalf. Our history in agents is longer than our generalized model work, he says, referring to the game-playing AlphaGo system developed nearly a decade ago. According to Hasabis, Astra is significantly closer to the functionality of a true real-time AI assistant than earlier solutions. When Gemini 1.5 Pro, the most recent version of Google's standard major language model was released, Hasabis says he felt the underlying technology was robust enough to allow an application like Astra to start working properly. However, the model constitutes one part of the product. We had components of this six months ago, he explains, but one of the issues was just speed and latency. Without that, the usability isn't quite there. For the past six months, one of the team's top priorities has been accelerating the system. Google AI Project Astra provides a multimodal and conversational AI solution. While Astra's primary functionality, answering queries, creating text or analyzing photos may sound familiar, its distinguishing feature is its multimodal capabilities, quick processing and interactive ability, as demonstrated at Google I.O. 2024. Google envisions Project Astra as a versatile AI agent that can interpret and respond to a variety of inputs, including text, graphics, video, and voice. The journey to Project Astra incorporation. Google has said that some of these agent capabilities will come to Google products like the Gemini app later this year. It's likely the public won't get instant access to the entire Project Astra experience. While certain features of Astra may come in Google Apps gradually until 2024, the full experience, which may require specific hardware, is expected to arrive later. Project Astra's early demonstrations highlight its capabilities. In one case, Astra utilized a phone's camera to recognize things in a scene and responded to cues to highlight specific elements. Other demonstrations included identifying landmarks in pictures, recalling lists, interpreting code snippets, and answering math issues. Astra's multimodal feature, which combines visual and oral input with natural language processing, is critical to its improved capabilities. Hardware is a major obstacle for Google AI Project Astra. While Google has demonstrated Astra on smartphones and smart glasses, 
it has been hinting at seamless integration with other devices. Potential incorporation into wireless earphones or other form factors may arise in the future. However, the processing capacity needed for Astra's real-time functionality is an obstacle, demanding either significant onboard processing or a rapid cloud connection. Google's announcement of Project Astra demonstrates the company's continuous commitment to the advancement of AI. Tech giants are increasingly competing for the same turf, and they appear to have a vision for how AI may impact your life and the ways people could benefit from it in the future. Astra is currently in its early stages of development and simply demonstrates one possible way to engage alongside a system like Gemini. The DeepMind team is still investigating how to effectively combine multimodal models and balance massive broad models with smaller, more targeted ones. We are still in the speeds and feeds stage of AI, where every incremental model is important and parameter sizes are a major concern. However, Hasabis believes that we will soon begin to raise numerous concerns about AI. Better questions. Questions regarding what these assistants may perform, how they do it, and the way they will improve our lives. Although technology is far from flawless, it is rapidly improving. That brings us to the end of this video. What are your thoughts about these mind-blowing tech advancements? How can these developments affect our lives? Don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section and share this video with your friends. Let's meet again with another interesting video.